Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another FMV game. This is Bloodshore, an interactive action movie about a televised battle royale between high-profile streamers, entertainers, and death row inmates. We'll be controlling the fate of Nick, a washed-up actor who fights for a life-changing cash prize. Will we become victorious in the Tournament of Champions, or die horribly to a TikToker? Let's begin to find out. I've got what it takes. I think. The contestants, the ultimate prize. One winner. Are you ready? I think so. I think we're ready. It's showtime! Welcome to the third season of Killstream, the number one show on the planet, where 50 lucky contestants compete for a chance to win 10 million dollars. That's a lot of clams. Hall of Fame and have it all. Killstream, now entering its 13th season, has been criticized by human rights experts for its brutality. Having claimed the lives of 210 of its 470 contestants thus far. Showrunners Alan Cork claim that all contestants are fully aware of what they are opting into. They are volunteers. They chose to be in this arena. Volunteers, please. They're desperate. Poor, brainwashed, often completely unstable. My agent says it's going to be really good for my career. Any publicity is good publicity, right? Many would argue that the corporation is abusing its to take advantage of the destitute and are responsible in large part for the cutthroat society we live in. Eugene Kristoff, when you created the show, you put the world's deadliest death row inmates on an island to battle to the death. The winners of the first few seasons have become some of the wealthiest people in the world. Yes. Is that justice? I guess I have what it took. Death or glory? Death or glory? The contestant numbers have risen in line with the economic downturn. What could we do? We opened it up to everyone. These people are a byproduct of the society created by you. Some would say you're a coward having tapped out. Well, they can say that to my face. You have been inundated with application. They have been ground into dust by the boot heel of the rich and powerful, who are now using them for their own entertainment. Oh, socialist mother... <laughs> If I didn't know any better, Chris, I'd say you were accusing me of exploiting the poor. I'm not the only person to find your show utterly abhorrent. Have you ever fired a gun before? Don't ask dumb questions. The terms are agreed upon by both parties. I yeah. don't... So you think it's fine to witness deaths on television? Since the beginning of time, man's been pitted against his fellow man in combat. Surely we've evolved from a more barbaric time. I'm not so sure we have. I don't think we have either, to be honest. Anyone. And that's it for now. Turn the camera off. Turn it off. This is what the people want. They keep watching. Hey, it's Scarlet. So, if you don't already know, I'm on my way to the island. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little freaked out. Scarlet, influencer. Oh, it's a thousand to one. Um, Oh dear. Dad, don't sweat. This is it, people! It doesn't get any realer than this! Auto, Strike Royal Player, 34 to 1. Watching your socials for live updates. Share with your people. Thanks so much. I'm gonna forget all these names in like literally two seconds. And that's ourselves, Nick. An actor. To find an ally early. Helps keep you alive through the chaos of the first few rounds. Okay. Um I have set this to pause it uh, because I believe there's going to be a lot of information thrown at us. And uh, I do agree. I do agree uh, that allies would be would be good in this instance, but it's Battle Royale. There can only be one winner, right? So I'm going to disagree. I'm going to try. I'll be the lone wolf. I'll try. I'll try and get through this being a lone wolf. I don't think it's going to work, but it's what I would. Uh, it's what I would do. I've seen Battle Royale, Hunger Games, all those type of things. There is there is going to be a moment where we're going to have to, you know, 
team up with someone, I guess. But let's just go for this now. Sounds like that would get complicated. And I'm not a complicated person. I'm a very simple man. Gav, extreme vlogger. Tish, video game streamer. She's gonna have good reflexes, right? Game streamers, shooters mainly. Mm. Should come in handy. What about the cannibal over there? Life is all or nothing, yeah? You know that. I'm our people out there. They know You that. just lost half your subscribers in the last six months. Has that got anything to do with this? Dev, travel vlogger. We all know it. Now it's time for the world to see. I'm gonna be streaming the truth. Yo, are you gonna get down my face? Rhea, MMA fighter. Eighteen to one, good odds. My money's still on the pedo ring. Oh jeez, Ari, podcaster. Was he like um one of those? Uh, so, what's your story? What do I just say? I'm an actor, or do I be discreet with this? I don't. So far, I don't know. Why should I give them any information? If I give them information, they're going to use that against me, possibly, maybe. So I'll be discreet. Mate. That's Nick fucking Romeo. Oh dear. Wait. Mikey Lizard. Who? You didn't watch the Wolf Boys movies, Tish? I thought I was a washed up actor. You? Name's Gav. Extreme blogger. You're not one of those idiots that follow around the cartel and gun runners, are you? Just trying to get the most extreme stream I can. Well, you can't get more extreme than this. Extreme! The first one of these was set on Jeffrey Epstein's island. Oh dear. Who knows? We'll find out one way or another. Hurry out! Woo! We're just approaching the edge of the drop zone. Later, fucker! <laughs> Wait, we're not! You don't have a parachute! Make sure you pull the cord on the left. Do it too soon, you're in the sea. Do it too late, well, I guess it's someone else's problem. You're about to jump out of a perfectly good airplane! How do you feel about that? Do you have? I tried to possibly avoid it if I could. <laughs> uh, I like that's an option. I guess that would be an instant game over. And they're off. Our first contestants are on their way. There they go. Uh, there's not, nothing like having a green screen and a wind machine in your face. I'm not sure she'd actually be able to get her phone out. Oh, do I have to? I have to be paying attention now. No, it's all right. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> Ricky, pro gamer. Um, what? He doesn't have a cord? Oh dear. And there's our first death. Damn, son. I think he would just be a red splodge on the beach, but um, there we go. That's Bloodshore for you. Um, I like the I like the concept. I like the whole battle royale, Hunger Games. You know, fifty people fighting to the death, cash prize at the end. Yeah, it interests me. Track how you're doing from the pause menu. How am I doing? Team morale, twenty five percent. Audience opinion, 100%. Romance, strength, and insight. Okay, that's interesting. Don't think it's going to mean anything in the long run, but you never know. You never know. There was obviously a lot of info at the very beginning, but um, exploiting the poor? Never heard of such a thing. Uh, <laughs> I wouldn't be really surprised if something like this, maybe in the next 10, 15 years, did become a reality. But um, okay, we've um, we've got our... We can keep tabs on our... A team morale. So we are going to have to team up with people then, I guess. If there's anyone I'm going to team up with, I think it's going to be the MMA fighter. Or the pro gamer. Did someone sabotage his parachute then? Really? We don't get disqualified for this, right? This ain't on us, yeah? Hey, can you send me that? Check out the stream. A hundred thousand watching now. Her last season's finale had over a hundred million concurrent viewers. Don't worry, kid. 
I'll make sure the whole world is watching when you get nailed. Nice. Stop Scarlet or leave her to it. Um, oh, right. Scarlet's the... Yeah. I think that's going to increase some team morale, if that means anything. Don't know. Or that could make her angry with me and put her on my hit list. Yeah. I'll stop Come her. On. That's enough. No way. Look how many people are watching. This could be this season's first fatality. I'm going to persist. Seriously. Let's head to camp. Yeah, Nick's right. Ah, did we just make ourselves an ally? I think we did. So, we're not automatically against each other right away. I don't really know what the rules are here. Where are we? On a beach. Surely we'd be trying to kill each other straight off the bat, no? Look sharp, people. You're on camera. Here this guy's in line. Kill stream 13. It's that time again where I'm going to be live kill streaming 24-7. Stay with me for a live reaction. Psychopaths and Wolf Boys, have we got a season of Killstream in store for you? We'll be checking in with our viewers and getting your thoughts on this year's contestants. A hot favorite going in, Nick Romeo. What a hunk. <laughs> Not sure he's a team player. Does he have what it takes? The show doesn't start yet, folks. Our contenders will spend the night on the island before the game begins. So, right, I see. Okay, that makes sense then. Because the countdown starts now. Well, if I'd known that from the start, then I would have been trying to make allies straight off the bat. I guess we're going to get regular updates from the kill stream. Is that right? Seriously, what is this? This isn't the island. It's different every time. Yeah, but it's usually warm, sandy beaches. But we could only afford a little forest. My oh, mines. Be where you stand. They're everywhere. Um. What? I mean, that could get Scarlet out of the way very quickly, perhaps, if we're being fun with it. Yeah, let's just be fun with it. Kaboom! <laughs> oh, he just means his <laughs> response. The using of force players close to each other keeps the game interesting. There must be hundreds of thousands. Well, that explains why they couldn't afford to send us to the Bahamas. They blew the budget on explosives. Hey, we all know what it's like. Anything to get the views. My agent's gonna hear about this. And third-rate acting. We're not here for a vacation. So mines are gonna be a thing, huh? We're gonna have to be careful of the mines. What's this? The fire We're festival. The house. You're not catching on, are you? Oh, come on. Uh, it's not that bad. Fucking paradise. Try spending six weeks in the rainforest with nothing. No shelter, except what you make for yourself. So he's like a Bear Grylls type right. person, right? No, oh, it's four weeks in the Amazon. What's that? Bear? There's no bears here. You don't even know where here is. Well, he's right, judging by the foliage and the... I could give a fuck, Survivor Man. It's probably just a bird. A bird? I don't think it's just a bird. Check it out, then. Um, it could just be two people getting hanky panky in tent. I'm gonna go investigate. Why not? I could get my head blown off straight away, but. Our hero. Careful. Hello, motherfuckers. <laughs> what took you so long? Care to join me? I think Ari's got the right frame of mind, having a few brewskis. Another? No, I'm good. Yeah. Nothing like being drunk while you're killing people on an island, right? Hey, Nick. What are you doing here? Like, I mean, you must have done all right after them movies. You kidding? He hasn't worked in years, got fucked over by the studio. Well, now that I'm trying to make friends, I'll be light-hearted about it. It's like water for ducks back. It's fine. Writing my biography? <laughs> it's 
Sorry, man. It was on TMZ. Rules are at 9 a.m. You need to get some sleep. So, what, they give the word and we go at it? That's the general idea, yeah. What's to stop us from killing each other tonight? Beer. Disqualification. I have to wait for the broadcast. Ah. They've got eyes everywhere. Shouldn't we team up? For the early rounds. Watch each other's backs through the crazy part. And then what? We're still breathing. We'll deal with it then, I guess. Fuck turning into the night. You know what they say about the early bird. I don't think Survivor Man is um, liking the well, team spirit. Teaming up, I mean. Of course you are. Nah, it's not for me. I don't play team games. I'll promote it. Do you want to make the final ten? Or go down first? Well, like you said. It's complicated. Oh, he's trying to be a lone wolf. How has that done for our team morale? Let's see. Um, nearly there. Nearly 50%. Um, I'm going to try again. Persistence is key, right? It's common sense. No one fucks with a group. The bigger, the better for now. Man's a top out, I mean. What? No way. Chicken dinner all the way. <sighs> no chance. What? You're going to win? Yeah. Why not me? Guys, you cannot be serious. <laughs> they have got you all fooled. This is just a playground. What on earth are you talking about, Paddy Power? It's all fake. For TV. And casual racism there? No one believes in God anymore. This is the new church. Opiate for the masses. Alencor? Run by the Russians. Or the Illuminati? Definitely the fucking Illuminati. Like just a bunch of fucking old white men making the rules. I mean, look at this place. What do you mean? Where was like a fucking clan rally? Uh, hello. It wasn't the creator of Killstream black? Yeah, and where is he now? You're just paranoid. You know, there's lots of other landing groups. And now we've got the conspiracy nut calling me paranoid. Big news, baby. Fuck you. And what about you, princess? Hmm? That bad. Ah, oh, come on. It's better than having a death wish. Well, I'd sleep with one eye open if I was you. Yeah. Especially with Hannibal over there. <laughs> I mean, you know the story, don't you? What? He's a survival blogger. He spent four weeks deep in the Amazon Basin, mm. the minor royal, found themselves in trouble, got separated from the support crew. We found Dev alive and well. Should have starved to death. Would have starved to death. What? His partner didn't come back. Mm. No. Finger looking good. You're fucking with me. No, it's true. Apparently he came back three kilos heavier. <laughs> He's only sitting a few meters oh, away from you. Great. I'm sure he could probably hear exactly everything that you're saying, but okay. Right. Night one, and some shaky alliances of the Wolf Boy camp. But can Nick Romeo pull it together before it's too late? Let's see what else. I'm liking none of the other people so far. Audience polls are in. The jury's still out on Nick Romeo. What's your opinion? Can't lie, he's doing alright so far. But if he wants to go far on his thing, he's gonna have to up his game. Has he got what it takes? Remains to be seen. Come in. I've landed on the island. Location unknown. Oh. Roger that. So I'm a double agent or something, am I? You knew about this? Location change. And now that I have, do you know where I am? We are currently unable to get your coordinates. GPS on your device has been blocked. That's great. And what about extraction? Do you at least have a plan to get me out of this place? Your best priority is completing the mission. Fuck that! Fuck that! I'm out here risking my neck! Complete the task and you'll be safe. What is my task? You don't even know where I am! I need some goddamn proof you can help me here. Look for a communication tower. Once you upload the payload, 
Well, I can't trust myself, apparently, because I don't, don't even know what my mission is. Dismissive or joke? Um, so the guy on the other end of the walkie-talkie was it sounded Russian. So Ari might be a little bit right, but it looks like to me that I'm out here trying to get some kind of upload for them. Um, I mean, she's just blatantly heard me on the radio. So if I'm dismissive, then she'll... Oh, God. Let's go with a joke. Now, if I told you, I'd have to kill you. Hmm. That didn't do well for my uh, team morale, perhaps. So it seems like we're going to be teaming up with some people to get rid of the death row inmates and the other groups that have landed on the island. I was here when we got up for the broadcast. Should we open it? No, don't. Why? You do it then. I will. Why wouldn't you open it if it's been left on the table for you? Okay. Go on, get in there, Sean! I'm leading by example. Showtime. Time to get dolled up. Or it could be 30 minutes until the briefcase the explodes, you know. We don't really want to see Ari taking a dump, do we? Dev's gone. Good. That guy was creepy AF. This one too. What's up? Thought she'd left with Dev and Rhea. Not Rhea too? What a shame. She was such a hoot. Going somewhere? Yeah, there's a little scout around. Get a lay of the area before game time. Is that what you do in War of Duty? War what? No. He's a camper. What's that? He's a pussy. Plants himself in cover and waits for the other players so he can take them all. What's wrong with that? Sounds like a pretty good idea to me. Uh, it's bullshit. I never camp. But screw this. I'm gonna scout the area. Hmm. And we'll be straight back after these short messages. People's lives. Well, I think the question is, if this was reality, would you take the option to go on an island on a battle royale? Was it 10 million? Tempting. Auto back yet? Not likely. Oh yeah, remember him. I didn't expect it. I know, right? I thought it was going to be the one with the uh, eye patch. The Korean. No, that was... Uh... Sun Woo. Ah, that's it. <laughs> Classic. Oh, 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 here it comes. Good morning, Islanders. Let's cut to the chase. You know why you're here. 50 contestants split up into six landing groups spread around the island. Your task is to survive by whatever means necessary. And to help you along the way, we will be airdropping crates of weapons, armor, and other goodies. That's good to know. And just in case you were thinking of changing your mind about all of this, we have covered the island in smart minds. So don't think about swimming home anytime soon. <laughs> and every time you hear this sound, that means another set of minds have been activated around the island. So you better keep moving inland if you want to keep dancing the foxtrot, if you know what I mean. We've got the usual mix of fame-hungry wannabes, stone-cold psychos, and crazies. But in a callback to the very first kill stream, we're bringing back Death Rose Rogues Gallery. Really? To fight alongside your favorite Z-listers. <laughs> no offense. And in more serious news, this time around, we're changing things up a bit. This year, there will be no tap outs. What the fuck? That's right. You're all in it to win it. No 
rescues, no tactical dropouts. This year, you've got to give it your all. This is insane. You will shortly receive your first weapons drops, not too far from your current position. So move fast. But with half the planet watching you right now, you're already a superstar. Now go! Put on a show! Bastards. They can't do that. Well, they just did. I signed a contract. Ah, but did you read it? I mean, I did. It wasn't exactly binding on their part. Fuck you! I'm calling my agent. I gotta attempt to inspire the team. Come on now. They might help me out. No, I'm assuming they're gonna on. help me out. We gotta keep it together. This is just what they want. Panic. Let's try again. Bit louder this time. But you guys knew what you were getting yourselves into. If your lives were really worth living, you wouldn't be here right now. Look, I get it. You're scared. We all are. But this is still the greatest opportunity you've ever had. Yes, the risks are higher. But just think, if you win this, you are set for life. Oh. <laughs> Yikes. What a loser. Well... Shit burgers. That didn't work. Fuck it. Let's go get those weapon drops. Not looking good for Nick Romeo. What's your take? What a loser. <laughs> Might as well give it up, Nicky boy. God damn it. There's no eye in team, but there is eye in kill. <laughs> well, I guess from here on in, I'm not going to try and inspire people. That's what we should do. We lay low and ride it out. You know what? Just check the map. Why be so dismissive of camping? I mean, it's a tactic. We should be right on top of it. What does it look like? I imagine it's going to be a crepe. Fuck you, douche. Fucking trolls. Would you be allowed to have your phone on the island? And I thought they couldn't locate his GPS like the Russian dude that was on the walkie-talkie, so how would her phone be working? I smell a plot hole. But hey, we got weapons. That's good. Now we are armed, and we can defend ourselves. Always a good thing. No, apparently not. Um, is that... So the first one I picked up was the one on the left? Is that what we're saying? And that wasn't working? Um... Yeah, we'll give her the, the gun that's not working. Okay, these are all pretty old. We should only use them if we need to. <laughs> They're screwed. Jesus. How does it work? Oh. God damn it. I'm gonna give away our location. But her gun was working, so does that mean I've got the gun that's not working? I think I've made a terrible mistake here. Um, yeah, I think, um, my last investigation skill was all right with the briefcase, but I'm thinking it's time to get back to the others. No, we're going to investigate. Don't shoot. I'm not armed. Where's your landing group? I'm on my own. I, I overshot the landing been out here all night. Hmm. Should we shoot him? I'm right here, bitch. What did you say? Has the game actually started yet, though? I do this. Um, I don't think I want to do it. I will ask him to join. This could be a really bad decision, but I'm kind of getting the feeling that the broadcast hasn't started yet, so if I do kill him, will I be automatically disqualified? So I'm going to ask him to join. 
we've lost a few already. How can we trust him? I don't trust you. We're all here for the same thing. Hey, hey that sounds like a plan. Uh, I'm sorry about what I said before. I mean, you threatened to kill me. What's your name? Simon. I think Simon could be what a psychopath. Happened? We heard gunfire. That was Annie Oakley over there. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? Uh, this is Simon, another ally. Did you find uh, anything? We wouldn't go that far. Somebody already got to the drop. There wasn't much there. Hey, do I know you? Hmm. Yeah. He's one of those death row guys. Blew up that NFL stadium. 130 dead. Fuck this then. You wow. make me sick. I had money on that game. Oh, hold it. Um, I don't know him either. Why would I be defending him? Sorry. I mean, we're going just on Ari's word, which could be complete and utter shit. But I don't know him. Why would I be defending him? No. Oh, shit. Wow. Fuck. Well, I didn't see that coming. Is that guy dead? I guess the game has started then, but we haven't shot him, so if she gets disqualified, that's not on me. Yikes. This guy's fucking dead! Well, that's the name of the game! Big news, guys! This shit's fucking real! It's fucking real! I'm gonna go with the flow, you know? I'm gonna give it a go, I may even win this fucking thing, who knows? Are you out? Has Nick forgotten why we're all here? <laughs> it's not live stream, buddy! SMH. Down to 30 in no time at all. Now it's getting interesting. Yeah, Choco Boy 89. Says that two of the landing groups just ripped each other to shreds right at the start. Ah. Convenient. Do you have anything in camo? Camo's Who doesn't so like a right good now. getting powered yeah. up montage, eh? You never see it anywhere. Seriously, though, what is this shice? These guns are almost antique. We should head for the center. See that? What about it? It's got to be something. Looks like a communication tower to me. There's a bridge up ahead. From there, we can either go straight through or we can go around. Hmm. The straight ahead option doesn't seem very safe to me. Let's go around. I say we flank it. Keep our eyes open. Sounds like a plan. All right. Let's do it. Let's go. Way to go, Nick. That was weird. Yeah, that's pretty much how I react when I'm in the woods. Just yelling at bugs and insects. The drones are always watching. A puppy stops whining when it grows up. I always wanted a puppy. Talk to Gav, talk to Tish. Um, I think we need to talk to Tish because Gav seems okay. She's the one that has looks and appears to have a bit of an attitude to me. So we're going to try and try and turn her around. Icebreaker. Let's go with an icebreaker. How much does a polar bear weigh? Enough to break the ice. Guess you've heard that one, huh? Yep. Very funny, dickhead. Wow. I'm not really it's winning over the, the people here. Fame seekers, conspiracy nuts. You weren't far off earlier. What you said about our lives not being that great. Let's just leave it at that. Sorry. 
So what's your deal with Otto? Nothing. He's just another misogynist asshole. I deal with pricks like him online every day. Scumbags who think women don't belong anywhere but the kitchen. Wow. I didn't get that vibe off it. But what does it matter in here? Casual sexism isn't as bad as wanton murder. That's very insightful of you, Tish. <laughs> Shut up, dickhead. Oh, so we got a we got a choice of flirting or not flirting. Um Ah, uh, why not? Why not? You know you're kinda of pretty when you're mad. Oh dear. Hey! <laughs> you need to work on your flirting. And we can talk to Gav as well. So we can both we can do both of them anyway. So hmm. We won't bother with the icebreaker this time. So is it living up to the hype? We've got to be out of our minds. Damn. <laughs> okay. Maybe I should have started with an icebreaker. I'm not sure the uh, the shoulder pads are actually going to protect us from anything much, to be honest with you. Seems like Nick might be on for some loving. So, is there romance in the air? Looks like he's into Tish. She may be into it too. <laughs> more mines are being placed, forcing us more into the center of the island. I think, at any rate. Let's just have a quick look at the tracker then. I suspect none of this is going to matter anyway, but hey, the team morale's not bad. Audience opinion's 100%. Nearly romance. I don't know about strength and insight, but yeah, all right, okay. What is it? Oh, come on, guys. Did you not prepare for this at all? Whoa, oh. easy now. Where the hell did you get to? I told you, I've been out scouting. That was half a day ago. And I covered a lot of ground. There's a lot of weird motherfuckers out there. We've got a more immediate problem. There's another team up ahead. Coming in this direction. Hmm. Well, they'll be headed towards shore. We can't trust him. He could be setting us up. Yeah. Fuck this guy. What did I do to you? I mean, he has been away from the whole group, and he's right. Why would there be people coming towards the shore? Um, you know what, though, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Is he leading us into a trap? He's leading us into a trap, isn't he? He just said another team was up ahead. I'm gonna trust him. I think he's telling the truth. <sighs> Nick. Sorry, I just don't think he'd fuck us like that. Okay, we need to get ready. If they're headed this way, we need to get the jump on them. Otto, head back to the perimeter. If you see anything, signal us. Signal how? Smoke? I can't whistle loud enough. You got a phone? Yeah, let's swap digits quickly. So what's the plan? Maybe we should camp. Am I using that right? Look! more of them. Oh, there's a whole team. Bring that ready. Yes. This is what we want to watch. Bloodshed. People playing real life paintball, but with bullets in the forest. Oh. Nice one, Tish. One down. Don't just stare at your gun. Oh dear. Well, that's Scarlet down. Is that because we gave her the the crappy gun? I think it might be. Mm. 
We gotta return fire, come on. Was that the survivalist? It was, yeah. Okay. Is that you, wolf boy? Now we're putting on a show. Fuck you, Hannibal. Hey, what does someone with blue blood taste like anyway? You're gonna eat those fucking words. I love to stay in chat. After them! Wait! Got some mines on the bridge. Oh, we gotta save Tish. Sorry, Gav. Bloody hell. Oh, oh shit. It's a good job I followed you down. A good work on the bridge there. You really showed him. Oh dear, Ari. It's your lucky day. Dev the Cannibal has cornered his own landing squad. And that creative reuse of mines means Gav sees his final destination. Tish Tasker and Nick Romeo were also caught in the blast. That's a million dollars. Coming soon. Took your crew back and so we lost two people there. We lost Scarlet and we lost Gav. Would there have been an option for me to save both of them? Probably, if I'd have given uh, Scarlet the gun that worked. Oh, my head. What happened? Looks like the mines. They must have figured a way to reuse them. The heck? I might be impressed with my ears stop ringing. You see what happened to the others? I didn't see shit. I think Scarlet went down in the shootout, though. Yeah, she got Where shot in the we? face. Oh, thank God. We're five miles inland. Fuck. The thing again. What is it? Are you okay? It won't be this that kills me. I got a boo-boo. Turn that off. Why? We got lost. We need to go dark. What are you talking about? I don't know what we're talking about because I don't even know what my mission is at the moment. You know, it's great to be part of a real team. I think you made the right choice. Oh, Scarlet. Oh, dear. <laughs> Fuck it. Now you're a star. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, it's kind of to put her out of her misery, but um, looks like. Oh dear. Oh jeez. That was that was goofy as fuck. <laughs> Looks like Dev is our main antagonist, the um, Bear Grylls survivor type guy. Ah, uh, she got the million followers though. Here you go. Apologize to Scarlet's friends and family. Let's take a moment now in remembrance of her life. Moving on. Tenders left in the game, but it looks like that's the end for Nick Romeo and his team. But I guess we saw where his heart was right at the end there. 
It was mm. so beautiful. They would have been perfect together. Maybe they made it, right? But leaving Gav on the bridge? That was cold. Do you want another drink? Yeah. Well, I've only been given a 50-50 choice. I've got to pick Go one of them. Down. Let's take a breather. There's something up ahead. What? What? What are you looking for? What are we looking for? You need to tell me what's going on. That head case Ari was almost right. Well, that can't be half a landing group for dead. No, not about that, but this game is fixed. What do you mean? The winner's picked out before the game begins. Ooh. Wow. Guns are real. The mines are real. How could you possibly stop someone from getting killed? It's not a sure thing, but from what we can tell, they do everything they can to give them the advantage. We? I'm not here to win, Tish. You need to stop speaking in fucking riddles. I've been sent here by a group called the Alliance. They've sent me here to expose the truth. That the corporation used deep fake technology to rig the outcome of Kill Street. Is it like the running man? Hold on, so what you're saying is... Computer-generated scenarios. They can alter the broadcast in real time to make things play out the way they want. Why? Why can't they just let it play out? The winner's a puppet. All the fame and power that come from winning this thing can be controlled if they know who the winner is. Alan Corp are fucked. They've been hemorrhaging money for years. They're on the ropes. The cost of running this meat grinder adds up. The bribes the countries that host it, the jurisdictions that broadcast it, the lawsuits from the contestants' estates. Then with audiences dwindling, they had to come up with a plan, so they started fixing it. We're not sure when, but when the creator left, there were big changes behind the scenes. The winners always became big stars, right? But then they didn't need the corporation anymore, so they decided to change that. With the winners in their pockets, they managed to keep things afloat for a while longer, but now they're getting desperate. That's why the rules keep getting more brutal. So you were being serious about the no tap rules. They're doing it to boost the ratings. And the puppet, who is it? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Here, let me. That's a good field dressing. You'll live. Okay, so you're here to expose all of this? How? Yeah. Why did the Alliance send you? Let's just say I have a reason to hate Alan Court. The Alliance knew this and it was a safe bet my lead balloon of a career. They blackballed me in Hollywood. They gave me this device, a payload, that I need to plant in the corporation's network. Okay. If they can get in, they can hijack the stream. Okay. Expose it all. The deep fakes that fix everything. So why are you telling me this? Why isn't the Alliance helping you? They must have known something was up. They switched locations at the last moment. They must have known they had a mole. The Alliance are still scrambling to find out where we are. What about GPS? Our phones? Locked. All signals in and out of this place go through Allen Corp's network. This device was meant to be invulnerable to their control, but the blast back there must have knocked it out. I need to find a way into Allen Corp's network, a comms tower. Maybe I can find a way to get a message out. We even find out where the fuck we are. There's got to be something like that around here. They're streaming from all these drones 24-7. Let me see that. Even if the radio is broken, we should be able to get some info from the storage. I'm not dying on this fucking island for nothing. Hmm. Do we trust her? Do we trust her? Yeah. Trust you with my life there. Don't worry, soldier. It's in safe hands. It's getting dark. We should lay low until it gets light. We might get a view of another tower then. She's gonna run off during the night, isn't she?
We should take it in turns keeping watch. Toss a coin. Uh, no need. I'll go first. You sure? You may as well have the conversation. How'd you end up here? That's complicated. Time to pour our hearts out. Not much call for an aging child actor. I didn't make the transition. Drinking drugs took over. And TV and film, that all changed. Reality killed the TV star. Oh, you're breaking my heart, Mikey. Fuck you. You blame the corporation for that? You remember the other Nick? Nicky Merck? Guys are like a double F for one. Like Ant and Dick. What we're doing had a shelf life. It was Hollywood chews you up and spits you out. What do you do? Anything you can to stay on top. And so he did. Kill Stream season six. It's all starting to make sense. Drink and drugs made him a different person. Made him feel invincible. He thought this was the only way out. It is for some of us. Is Tish about to tell us her story? I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. I wanted to do something for my family. She's a pro gamer, isn't she? I look after them, so I thought I'd do the whole streaming thing about my only option but no matter what there's always cheaters someone tipping the scales so here I am I mean with the ad revenue for my channel since I've been in here that's gotta be something for them right yeah. what do they think of all this Told them. I'm sure they'll be watching on a TV now. now mm hmm. Jesus. No. This reminds me of that part in Wolf Voice 2 when you're on the run and you're sleeping in the subway station. I thought you didn't watch those movies. Come on. They were everywhere when I was a kid. Of course, I watched those movies. Oh, is she giving us the eye? Do we go in for the kiss? I think we're gonna go in for the kiss and get rejected. Let's try it anyway. Oh. That didn't happen in the movie. Bulletproof vest. I should have done this bulletproof. Unbelievable. Tish Tasker and Nick Romeo are still in the game. <sighs> Maybe there's more than meets the eye with these two. Ha! See? He's not dead. But Nick Romeo's not dead. I knew he wasn't dead. What, do you want to shag him or something? Oh, mate, fuck off. <laughs> Can't keep a good guy down, huh? Go, Nick! Go, Nick! <laughs> Lucky son of a bitch. Slippery fucker. Kelvin. You head east. Keep an eye on him. Don't worry, buddy. I'll look after you. <laughs> Hello. How are you? I was born in the darkness. You gotta keep on moving. Ah, oh, she's gone. I called it. I called it.
And we've given her the payload thing. Oh no, she's there. Should I doubt her? Hmm, no, let's just go. We should get moving. Oh, but it looks suspicious. Calvin, right? She's up to something. <laughs> You're not Calvin Biggs, are you? Oh my god, it is you. You were on America's Most Wanted, right? Hey, that was a crying shame what they did. Goddamn lamestream media and their goddamn witch hunts. I mean, so what if you took a busload of school kids hostage? You only <laughs> killed the teacher. Oh dear. You sure you saw something? I thought he might have seen an antenna. What other options do we have? Where are the others? Oh, easy guys, it's me. Look, I've been on you for 10 minutes. If I wanted you dead, you would be by now. Fuck. Still a good way to get yourself shot. <laughs> me? You need to watch your six, bro. I could have taken you both down. Then why didn't you douchebag? Well, with mouth like that, I just might next time, honey buns. I I was wondering what happened to the rest of the group. You know, whether you turned on them. I heard enough to know it wasn't you, obviously. Otherwise, we wouldn't still be talking. Now, what's this about an antenna? Oh, no. Otto knows our plan. <laughs> what's the difference between this island and a dead prostitute? Totally normal behavior for a psycho. This island still sucks. Why don't get is? If they can fake bits of it, why not fake the whole thing? Why bother going to the expense of hosting it in the first place? Too many variables. All the drama, power struggles, randomness of people is hard to script. Plus, I don't know whether you've noticed, but I'm seriously cutting corners this year. What the fuck even is this shit? <laughs> Amen. Batman, there's just too many people involved by the time I started fixing this shit. I mean, trust a handful of people at the top to stay quiet. They've got the most to lose. The winner's going to keep their mouth shut, but what about everyone else? So, who is it? You know, the puppet. The winners. I always seem to think it was all fake. You know, he really believed it. Maybe he was onto something. Maybe you know? it's you! Mysteriously popping up after an explosion one foot in, one foot out of the group? Seems a bit suspicious. Stop! It could be anyone. I've got my suspicions, but no use pointing fingers. It's gonna be Tish, isn't it? more than one for all we know. Where is this lead? West. Away from the center? Yes, yeah, where I saw the buildings. It's like a complex. It has to be something. with a spoon! Nick Romeo is still M.I.A. Maybe there's still hope. Or maybe the pieces are just too small. Uh, this is strange. They're not showing anything. This is bullshit. What the fuck is going on? The show's really gone downhill. Hmm. This plan is fucked. That's two clicks west, just past those trees. Past the mines? We just gotta get through the field. Isn't there another way around? So the ring of mines around the island is 200 meters wide. This open ground, it gives us an advantage. So we're leaving our lives as a chance. How can someone who joined a 50 to 1 battle to the death suddenly be so risk averse? And if this place you saw isn't what we're looking for? I don't know. It's better than fumbling around in the dark just hoping to come across something. <sighs> okay, what are our options? Well, there's one thing that I think might be possible. Go on. Well, you said those guys used the mines to blow up the bridge? Yeah. That means one of those assholes has figured out how to rig those mines to blow up on command. That means it can be hacked. If they can be hacked, then I can figure out how they're armed and maybe how to disarm them. 
So, what, we take a live mine and deactivate it by hacking? That sounds like it's gonna take forever. Not only for the first one. These mines are smart, which means it's probably part of a mesh network. They send a signal to arm, disarm from mine to mine. If I can figure out how to break one of these guys' security, I can maybe disarm the whole thing. Well, at least the area we're in. Wow, that sounds a like a... Mm -hmm. Okay then, fuckers. Why don't you go grab a big stick and get ready to prod and poke your way through the next 200 meters of open ground, meter by meter. I'm sure there's no risk there at all. I mean, both of them sound ridiculous. How does, isn't Otto a gamer? How does he know about all this stuff? Um, I obviously don't want to go wading through the open ground with the mines. Um, let's go with Otto's plan. This could be my downfall, but let's go with it. Come on then, nerd. Let's go get you a mine to play with. Are you fucking kidding me? He's gonna blow himself up. Probably. Fuck it. I guess he wouldn't be that big of a loss anyway. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? I just think I was gonna hack the mine. I need a computer. Don't worry, I can make sure it's not sending out anything that can track us, but we'll still be dark. But wouldn't the mine explode when he picked it up? That's a bad idea. Or are they timed? Is that I might have might have missed that one. I should do it. How do we know if it works? Well, Kablamzo! Over here, everything within a three meter radius should be disabled. How do we know? Try well, it. Doesn't explode. You fucking try it. You're holding it. Careful. Wait. What? Holy shit! You fucking idiot! It didn't work. Oh, really? <laughs> At least I gave it a go. You nearly got us killed, not to mention wasted our time. And that might oh, get dear. us in company. We'll have to move fast. What's plan B again? God damn it. His heart was in the right place, you know? His heart was in the right place. What's that? We gotta keep her pace. We gotta keep her cool. Doesn't matter. We step on a mine, we're just as dead. Exactly. You speed up, you're gonna make a mistake, you're gonna fumble. And you're going to blow yourselves up. Oh no, it's Ari. Run! Oh dear. Fuckers, why don't you go grab a big stick and get ready to prod and poke your way through the next 200 meters of open ground, meter by meter. I'm sure there's no risk there at all. Well, we're doing it the hard way. That didn't go according to plan. I thought by keeping the pace... We can make it. Really? We wouldn't be, you know, fumbling around, but um, obviously not. Fuck. I do like the rewind feature. So it looks like this is going to be a, a, a playthrough, a long playthrough. I was just going to go with, if Nick died, Nick died, that was it, game over. But um, we've got an automatic rewind. What's that? And now we'll speed up. Need to pick up the pace. 
case if we get caught out here, we're dead. But this time, we didn't explode into chunky meat sacks. I'm clench. Well, that wasn't so bad. Get down! Get down! Cover Tish, save Tish. Well, let's cover for her. Rope for the trees! We'll cover you! Oh dear. <laughs> I thought he was going to be like the big bad guy. But apparently not. Anywhere, folks. We'll be back in just a shake. Yo, you seen this on the subreddit? Deep fakes. Yeah. I'm not buying Something's it. Something's not right. They're that's saying fine. that's why Romeo is there. It's all a fix. Shut up. Not far now. Really? Why are we listening to him? Oh, we've come this far. Yeah, but where are we going? How do we know we can trust him? No, I don't like helping you either. Chill. Don't fucking tell me to chill. Why don't you tell Nick about yourself? Tish, come on. We gotta keep moving. He's not just some glory-seeking wannabe. Ah. Otto here is convicted of swatting another streamer. Oh, you bad boy, Otto. Swatting? Called the cops and said there was a hostage situation at the house of another player, so they would send an armed response. And what happened, Otto? He was killed. Oh, dear. I didn't mean Look, to... I, I don't care about anyone's past. The fact is... We're already in this situation, and we have to keep going. We're in the shit, people. Know he's not the puppet. How do we know you're not the fucking puppet? You wanna fucking hey, go? Hey, stop, stop. What's that? Fuck, I thought we were duck. We shouldn't be out this far. Come on. Bravo 2, we got some movement in Sector B. Here. Yeah, I can't see it. Hey, look at this. Must be close now. Hey, we should check for supplies. Hmm. See, I think the puppet. Uh, I think the puppet's Tish. So we go with her. She won't be able to get up to anything suspicious. Otto, wait here. Let's go, Tish. Think you can trust him? I don't know if I can trust anyone. Thanks. Uh, there's not much here. We need to keep moving. Be careful, Nick. Hmm. Did that give us any valuable intel? Oh dear. Right. That's why we did it. Drop the gun, Nick. What do you want? We found the puppet, Nick. <laughs> puppet. That's not very nice. What do you want? You, Nicky. Don't play coy with me. What <laughs> <laughs> the hell is going on? Uh, I want 
you, Nikki. This one, huh? I can see why it drives you so crazy. Ah, oh, Tish. How far back are we going here? Nick Romeo pops up again. That kid is just like the turd that won't flush. Betrayed by the one and only Tish Tasker. Maybe she could use more fiber in her diet. So hang on. You're not really taking either personal responsibility or even personal engagement. How would it be if I went over now and I just took your cravat and strangled you with it? I quite like this cravat. I wouldn't mind dying in this cravat, actually. It's one of my favourite ones. It would make fantastic television. You would go down in history. So would I. But don't you understand what I'm saying? You can either sink down into the gutter, into the mud, and if you don't mind me saying so, the shit, or you can lift people up. Why don't you want to lift people up? You have that opportunity, and we, believe it or not, we do have a responsibility. Do you have any sense of responsibility? One of the no. beauties of living in a modern society is that, in our shows at least, it's down to the consent of the contestants that are involved. But I'm saying you're not engaged in the argument. For you, it's just a job. It's just a thing. And these are people's lives! We must watch that we don't... The nonchalance in this man's face. I love it. We must watch that we don't sink down. I want to have a bath. Then have a bath. I want to have a shower and a bath and another shower and another bath after I've seen your program. This interviewer is just going off the rails. Do you not have any limit? No. In the end, what would be too much for you? Have you no shame? So hang on there, what happened? Because it rewound, so... Did we die? We were just knocked out. Is that what we're saying? Yeah, okay. For a moment there I thought she killed us. And that's why it rewound. But obviously not. Oh, Tish. We had a kiss and everything. You. What are you doing? Why don't you just kill us both and be done with it? Starting to feel a little funny, Nick. What'd you do? Didn't your mother ever warn you? Careful you spend the night with. Poison? Why? Oh. This isn't just about me. I have a family. Your plans? You've been working with Dev this whole time. Not all along. But when you told me who you really were... Uh, we should never have told people the secrets. Hello, Nikki. What is this fucking thing anyway? Can you hear me? Hello? Seems to be broke. Guess your buddies won't be coming to save you. I don't think this is going to have a great outcome for Nick. You know, they've tried this before to get a mole on the island. But this is the first time they succeeded. Who would have thought the Mickey fucking Romeo would be a goddamn spy? Ha! It's genius. Little Mikey grows up to be James Bond. I almost feel bad sopping you. Almost. My employers want to know who's costing them so much money. Me? I just don't want to have to deal with your bullshit no more. Why can't we just let everybody fight to the death like they're supposed to? Sure thing. And timing will fucking get started, cocksucker! Come on! Don't be like that. All they want is the names. They'll figure out the rest. You give that to them and we can all walk out of here. All of us. Even your little buddy over there. 
the execs at Alan Corr told me you'd be saving them so much money, they'd sweeten the deal. Think about it. We'd all walk out of here richer men. You have my word. <laughs> Your word means nothing. Fucking moron. So, Tish. Uh, she's gonna kill Otto. Oh, maybe so. But we can make it slow. Or is this gonna be a double cross? All of this just to protect some goddamn human rights activists. I mean, come on. Come on, Otto. It's just a little little cut we'll on the cheek. Soon enough. Yeah. You'll be able to survive that. Take a finger. Oh dear. Just one. Fucking assholes! I love how Dev's Fucking been assholes. getting people to do now all this dirty work for him. <laughs> First it was Ari killing Scarlet. Now he's getting Tish just to kind of remove fingers. No. She seems to be enjoying it, though. Just tell us who's behind the alliance. Do I even know who's behind the low? No, we've got to resist. Can't give in. Sorry, Otto. you got to just go through a little bit more torture. Fuck you. You know... You are kind of a dick. I mean, you could make this all stop. No, we've got to keep on resisting. I'm sorry, Otto. If we have to go through all your fingers, we're going through all your fingers. Ooh, he's going to run out of fingers. I'll find something else. Come on, Nick. We can do this all day. <sighs> Oh, is this literally going to get to the end? Uh, no, it's still, I can't give him the information. I can't give him the information. You disappoint me, Mickey boy. What should we do with this brick? He's dead. Hard to tell. Fuck it. No, no, no! Oh, sorry, Otto. Tish is a bad girl. I don't think I'd have held out that long and watched my friend go through all that. But then again... You don't have the name of the Alliance know. person, resistance, freedom fighter guy. Where are you going? I need to make a call. Maybe if we had just relented, then Otto would still be alive. But this is a battle royale to the death. You know, they keep on forgetting this. Have you been? And where's Kelvin? He blew up. Oh, fuck you! Tell me about us. Well, you found him. What's going on? Just wait here and make sure he don't go anywhere. Yeah. Right. I guess. Maybe we can turn Ari onto our side. He's the yeah. He's the conspiracy theory nut job, isn't he, sort of thing. So maybe if I tell him the truth, he'll help me. Maybe not. I think I'm on my own now. the final contestants now. Where the hell are they? Why aren't you showing us? Yeah, where the hell is Nick? They don't want us to see what he's up to. It's all fake. The people are rebelling. It's a bit far-fetched, isn't it? <laughs> that meant to be a bit of a self-awareness... Um, commentary going on there. 
Well, I think we're going to try and escape. Or is that they want us to do that? Nah, might as well. Might as well give it a whirl. Oh, well that was easier than I thought. We don't have any weapons though. Sorry, Otto. My bad. Shouldn't I take the payload thing? Why would you leave your weapons just by the door there? Who does that? Oh, Ari does that, obviously. Ah, uh, stealth takedown. Hmm. I think, uh, yeah, it's a stealth takedown. Gotta go with the stealth takedown. Hiya! One less combatant on the field, right? Well, if it's giving us the option, I'm going to search it. I already had a weapon, didn't I? Oh, now I've got two. Why am I throwing that one away? Why don't you go with two? John Wood is bad boy. Um, I think, well, fast went for us well last time, didn't it? So, in the minefield. We'll just knock him out. Why is it giving us the option now to search? Are we just searching for weapons? Because surely you just take the ammo, right? He just threw the gun on the ground and the magazine on the ground. Cool and calm, guns are blazing. <laughs> I think this is going to have the same outcome. Let's go in cool and calm. That's how we do things, Nick style. Well, fuck me sideways. <laughs> be a doll, pass me that antidote. I'm not going to be so nice if I have to ask again. Did we know that she had an antidote? Oh. Uh, Fucking poison. Nice. So much for keeping him alive. Well, that was before you told me the plan. Well. That's academic now, I guess. Jeez. Nick, what'd you say? We can still get on the blur and get this all sorted. I think the time has passed for that, my okay. friend. But we're almost there. What? The finale. Ah, uh, it is a running man. What chance do you think you had, you fucking muppet? See? The decision's already been made. The deep fakes are out there. Yeah, bloke and yours. As far as the world knows, you're already dead. Even if you survive this, you'll never make it off the island. They can't let you. But there will be survivors. One survivor anyway. Oh. Double cross. We knew it was coming. Fuck. Oh. <laughs> is crowned. What a year! More ups and downs than a bipolar roller coaster. Put the gun down, Tish. So we made it to the last two. What are the odds? I trusted you, Tish. 
There's a way out. We can both live through this. Maybe. Nah, she's dead to me now. There are no guarantees. If I get the chance. What if we did take Alan Corp down? Hmm. What then? This right here is the ultimate prize, Nick. That's bullshit. You just don't get it, do you? You may have lost your fame, your fortune, your friend, but it's different for me. I never had any of that to begin with. I came here for my family, and now I can have it all. And to hell with everyone else? You can't change it, Nick. We gotta look out for ourselves. There's a better way. We can put an end to all this bloodshed. You are better than this, Tish. You don't know me, who I am. You still have a choice. I never had a choice, Nick. Your move. Put the gun down, Tish. Please. It all comes down to this, the Mexican standoff. Oh no. Tish, Tish, Tish. If we spare her, is she just gonna come back and try and kill us? Is she just gonna is she just gonna try and go for it? But if we mm, if we shoot her, she's dead. So she can't have won the game. Sorry, Tish. The broadcast is out. You're dead anyway. The Alliance are streaming it right now. That's it, he fucking did it. Yes! Oh, what did I bloody tell you? Have you seen this? <laughs> uh, don't believe everything you see on TV, folks. <laughs> oh, fuck. Higher viewing figures than the game. You fucker. We're just getting word that, um... Start my chopper. What the fuck is going on? No fucking way. Stop! This is insane. Shut those cameras off! Game over. We only shot her in the side anyway, she'll be fine. So ultimately, my plan to lone wolf it did kind of pay off, I guess. I should have just done that from the get-go. Does this tracker actually mean anything? Team <laughs> so I had 2% team morale at the end. Um, at the romance, strength, insight, but uh, yeah, it all, it all kind of came crashing down at the end there. Um, yeah. Well, there you go, guys. That was Bloodshore. Um, a little bit camp, a little bit goofy, but um, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Um, sometimes you've got to have a bit of camp goofiness in there. I obviously clearly made a bad decision to trust Tish. I wonder if I'd have saved Gav instead of Tish, would the same thing have happened? Would he have just betrayed me at the end? Um, or can you, you know, leave the island with more than one person, perhaps? Um, a lot of different branching elements there. The rewind feature was, yeah, I, I did like that. So if you do die, it takes you automatically back to the next one. Yeah, I'd like to, I'd, I'd like to kind of try this again and sort of find out other other endings, other scenarios. Um, is there a scenario where Tish isn't a stooge? I thought the whole plot of the the company, you know, deep faking was very reminiscent of uh, the Running Man. Um, they've just basically copy and pasted that, really, haven't they? We couldn't, we didn't save Scarlet, um, and we didn't see the MMA fighter at all, did we? She just kind of went off her own way. I, I'm guessing she died somewhere out in the forest. We never saw her again. She she, she was at the start. And then she wasn't. Um, yeah, but Nick uh, finally got the broadcast for the Alliance, and uh, everyone, well, mostly everyone was happy. We decided not to kill Ari. Um, we, just, we just knocked him out. So he lives to fight another day as well.
Anyway, guys, let me know what you thought in the comments below. Like or dislike the video. And if you haven't already, please sub. It means the world to me. I'll see you on the next one. Stay ghoulish. Bye.